Greetings from Brooklyn. I love New York. And here is a look at the Setio home in Canarsie. Right now we are on Flatlands Avenue. And this is at the corner of East 93rd Street. And let's take a walk over and enjoy some of the Christmas lights here in ever beautiful Brooklyn, New York. And not only are there lights, it definitely draws people out, brings the community together, but there are also skating mice. <laughs> mice on skates. A lot of beautiful things to see here. A lot of detail and a lot of joy. And so uh, one of the things I really like most though is this is set up by the family. And you can see their name, the Sedio family going by. And this is not part of Visit Brooklyn or any commissioned display. This is just for the love and joy of the holiday. It's pretty amazing that someone has that much love and joy that they can bring a whole community together. But I did wonder, where do they put all of these pieces when it is not the Christmas season, especially this piece here? It is quite large. But then as I was looking at this, I noticed there were some details that really caught my eye. And it was the flag of Barbados, the flag of Jamaica, the flag of the United States. Yes, we are the melting pot of the world in New York. And they really captured that. There is Trinidad. And there was a little small, there is Jamaica. Uh, not Jamaica, Queens. <laughs> they did really capture the uh, melting pot of New York with that. And also speaking of pots, let's talk about the trash can. I thought that there was a cat in the trash can and indeed there is a gremlin so lots of small things to look for oh the air conditioner is a christmas present i don't know if they just received it or they wrapped it up uh, but a lot of small things to notice while you are here and this next one is pretty busy it is santa's workshop and there is a lot going on in this window and definitely thanks to the family for all of this effort. Now, I thought this fellow was a little bit mischievous, maybe from the Nightmare Before Christmas clue, gluing toys. And then I realized that he was creating them. The man of the hour, Santa Claus. And here we have a little bit more of the uh, hidden things to look for while visiting the display. If you're here when Santa's speaking, um, when he starts his routine, he actually says Merry Christmas from the Setio family. Very charming at that. But here it is, since this is a family home, there is the stockings with everyone's name on it. Do love that. And now in the message of keep Christ in Christmas, the entire garage becomes Judea. And here we are at the nativity scene. And while we are here, if you look up, you can see it is the garage. There is the garage door. And I don't mean that to poke fun. I mean it to show what a great job they did in utilizing their home to bring people together and celebrate Christmas and bring the, uh, the branches on the inside to make it look more like the manger. Very, very well done. Christmas lights are an invention of the United States of America. People would put lights on trees as part of the Yule tradition, but actually stringing them together like this was a creation of the United States of America. Now, a little bit about Canarsie, Brooklyn. This is the last stop on the L train. And so the, the personality of this neighborhood is the fact that everyone has a car. A lot of people will drive in this neighborhood because there is no public transportation as you go further out. And one of the things I do love about Brooklyn as well as Queens, uh, the Christmas lights displays. When you're walking down the block, you're right at someone's front door that's all decorated. And it's not far away when you go to view lights um, in the suburbs, you're rather removed from the experience. It's very charming to be in a community where you're right at someone's front door and it's all decorated in such an uplifting and inviting manner. Uh, Till next time, Merry Christmas from ever beautiful Brooklyn. I love New York.